In Hong Kong, the flu outbreak is being taken very seriously. Children wear protective masks and have their temperatures checked at the school gates. And now most of those gates have been shut on government orders. All primary schools, special schools and child care centres will be closed in the hope to slow down the spread of flu and to provide a chance to clean up. The order came after a seven-year-old boy became the third child to die from flu-like symptoms. So far, the deaths haven't been linked, but they're not taking any chances. The decision was made due to a rising trend of flu infections within the community. We estimate this peak season of influenza will continue for a few weeks. In this densely populated country, almost 200 suspected cases of flu have been reported in recent weeks, and hospitals say they're feeling the strain. The government will be hoping that its decision to start the school Easter holidays early will ease the problem. It's the first time schools have been closed down in Hong Kong since the outbreak of SARS in 2003. And the country's top health expert who studied that health crisis has been brought in again to look at this one. Jane Haddon, BBC News.